Hey, you. How are you? Good. How was the show? Oh, wonderful. Had a wonderful time. Four men playing my four favorite ladies. Yes, please. Very nice. The Rose character really didn't sound like Rose, but Dorothy did good, and the gentleman playing Blanche did good. Uh, and the Sophia character also did good. Uh, so that, that was a plus. And a pleasure. It was very interesting. I, um, family and I went to Chuckles Roadhouse after the show. Um, they took down my information but never bothered to put it in the system. So we ended up waiting for three hours. What? Yeah. You just sat there and waited for three hours? Yeah. How? Because they couldn't, uh, be bothered to actually put my name in the system for oh, that call ahead. Boy. Yeah. We had a nice server though. I mean that kinda evened it out the uh, roughly three hour rate. And the food was good. Yeah, the whole show was nice because it wasn't tied to an episode, so that was very cool. Um, so I quite like, I, I like that part of it, too. This has been going for a while. 
believe more than a year. I believe 20, 22 or 21 after the pandemic. Did you have work earlier? Yes, I did. It was okay? I had that gear and the voice? It was chaotic. Yeah, it's not done. The store is, yeah. Man. Week of Thanksgiving. Everyone's going haywire for stuff last minute. Mm-hmm. Nope, that's down too far. Yeah. And the good part is I, um, I, but my family has both turkeys for Thanksgiving and Christmas already bought, so we don't have to worry too much about that. How about you? How's that coming along for you? As far as I know, we're, we're good. I'm yeah, good. still thinking about possibly making a dessert like yeah. I did previous years. Mm-hmm. What you thinking about? Well... What did you do last year? Let's go back. Last year, I made kind of like an ambrosia type thing. Oh. Just with cherries and pineapple. Oh. Because, I don't know. My, in the year before that. Yes. I made a grape salad. Interesting. Yes. See, it's mm. funny. Well, I, it's I'm cut and dry. On the inside. What's that? I'm laughing on the inside. The, um. It's cut and dry with what I can make for the kids because my nephew is allergic to nuts um, and a lot of other stuff, and my niece doesn't like chocolate, so it kind of interesting. No, it, it, kid that doesn't like chocolate. Yeah, I heard of that. it cuts a lot out of the possibilities and what to make for these kids. Yeah. The grape salad when I made that called for pecans, and I was like, well, that's a big no. Yeah. Also, it's you know the most expensive thing in the menu. So, I said, I think I swapped it with Cinnamon Toast Crunch. Oh, and huh. I just kind of like crumbled it up and put it in there. Nice. So, what are you thinking about this year? I have no idea. I'll gotcha. probably just do the, we do the cherry ambrosia thing again, maybe. Okay. Or I'll Google around. I don't know. Yeah, Google, you still got some time to Google. Yeah. Yeah. If need be, you want to, we can do it at my place. <laughs> Yeah. Studio 716 West. Huh. I did not know that was there. Interesting. Granny, I don't normally pay attention to that little mall yeah. thing. So I have a... If we're going to make a tea on the boulevard here because... Viola's for dinner, local spot. Here in West New York, it's good, and it's only one location. It's in Niagara Falls. However, I have to go back the other way to Coles to return something to that Amazon stuff. So, the NFB team. Yeah, I'll put the music 
shine but you can still see you can make out the silhouettes and oh god it's a weird time of the year where like the sun's okay bright but it's like directly on you it's insane because at least when it's um spring and fall it's not that hard hitting light, if that makes any sense to anyone listening. I'm literally going under the speed limit just because of safety right now, so that makes sense. You gotta do what you gotta do.
Would you go again? Oh, yeah. Uh, <clears throat> yeah, uh, you'd be surprised how many people don't know about Viola, Sandy. Didn't know about Viola's and you. Which is... Unfortunate. I find it interesting the way you said Viola is on military. I've only known military is their only location, so. Makes me wonder if there's another location I didn't know about. Okay. Coming up on 
Oh, I gotta go by there. Something different's happening at uh, Steaksters. They have new signs. We gotta go. We might need to go back. All right. It's not Steaksters anymore. Whoa, that's a shock. Cause it was the other day. And wow, okay. But they haven't been open for a couple months. They've been using their brew truck. I guess their either rent was too high or something. They moved out. Huh. Okay, that's some breaking Western, Western New York news. Oh, this, uh, the, not the revs, the, uh, chase. Decorated all on Christmas. I'm like, oh my god, I love it. I got a couple of photos um, on my phone. It's, it's gorgeous. I, it's, <clears throat> I silver outfit, which you've seen. But um, I'm standing next to a tree, and I am looking fabulous. So is the tree. I think I've been the chaise once my entire life. Yesterday would have made my. Very un uneventful so far, which is pretty good. Is your phone have a flashlight on the front of it to do that, or is that just a filter to make it look brighter? Filter. Okay. I tried the um, flashlight, and it just reflected the glass. So I um, I don't use that. Hey, the tree's up. Oh, shit. Okay, I'm gonna go. Thank you. I'm gonna go see the tree. First time this season. Oh, they're putting the tree up. Oh. Even more fun. So it's possible it wasn't up when we got here. Right. Okay. I'm gonna go take some snapshots of the tree. Alright. see some fabulous nests other than my jacket in a few seconds. Uh, 
that's the Christmas tree. It is out. And it is, once again, fabulous. So that is the tree for the year. And it's up until New Year's, I think. So if you get a chance and you're in my area, I'm going to go do something and go look at the tree. It's the biggest one to my knowledge in the area. But I'm also curious where it comes from. I don't think it's a real tree, at least last year it wasn't. No, no, it's, it's not hard. It can't be. this year. It's very odd to see that it's the one thing that's not lit up. Now uh, that and that small thing over there too, next to it. Yeah, you don't remember what it was called. It was a sports goods store. Yeah, but it didn't last long, I don't think. Mm, I got a couple of good years. I don't know. Because I was at Walmart by the time it shut down. Oh, that Hot Wings place is open too now, it looks like. That's good. Yeah, so next to Skechers is Dave Hot Hot Wings, and it's particularly not a place for me. I don't like spicy food. And here's somebody being stupid on the NFB in dark clothing. Trying to cross six lanes of traffic. Seven, counting the turning lane. What a day to ruin my evening, though. Wow. No, I don't get offended either, but I'm just like sitting there reading my book. me to be offended, but it's like, why? Exactly. I am like, what is wrong with your life? You have to laugh at my coat. Maybe that's what the cops were there for. Maybe they were stealing. That'd be something. Ah, uh, yeah. Because I'm not going to make a scene. I don't want to make a scene. If they were more obnoxious than they were, Red light number one. So, do you want to take a guess at um, how many red lights? I'm thinking about maybe three, four. Total or so far? Total. Oh, it'll, I would guess five. Okay. Just guessing. Yeah. It's a nice uh, red light game that I play with uh, the watchers. Some play it, some don't. Most of them don't comment. I think like maybe around December 1st, we'll go more night driving, um, look at houses and stuff. sirens, I don't know why. And there's nothing around, but I'm hearing them. Hmm. Yeah, I don't know. Nothing on my end. 
No, I know. It's weird.
see what's going on with this. Oh, the steak place. Yeah. There's new signage in the window and everything. It's for sale. No. Yes. What the hell is this? The weekends only. Oh, hang on, let me turn. Oh, it's a Christmas superstore. Whoa! So that's why it's only weekends. It's only temporary. Okay. So there's a new temporary store here in Western New York. Uh, Buffalo Christmas Superstore, Signs of Perils, and Smokes. Well, that makes no sense. Smoke buys. It's the weekend, but it's also a Sunday night during a Bills game. Alright, so I get to tell my family that that restaurant we went to twice is closed. Any luck on your Google search? Yeah, it's Orlando that still has Mac tonight. Okay. Orlando. How about spaghetti? Let's see here. And when you're done with that pizza. Maybe we can go on a really, really long, long <laughs> ride along to those places. Except we can drive to Hawaii. Hmm. Well, I suppose you could go on a barge. The Philippines has it in their whole country. And one location in, again, Orlando. What is with Orlando? I don't know. Hmm. Let's try the McDonald's pizza. Imagine if those one place no, imagine that one last blockbuster sold the discontinued McDonald's food ah, that's an interesting concept Orlando, Florida. For pizza. Pizza. So, Orlando has pizza, spaghetti, and Mac tonight. Is it the same spot, I wonder? It's gotta be. Okay. Interesting question. Find me broccoli soup now. Because if it's on the East Coast, I'm going to Florida. Because I read Hawaii. If you read Orlando, that's it. We're going to Hawaii. I am bringing soup back. Boxes of soup. We're just eat our way through Florida too, so I mean, there's that. Okay. That's not giving me anything. I'll help. Yeah, that is the one hard topic to find any information on is there or deal over soup.
that was attempt number one. This is attempt number 